Expo and we just had the World Team Fusion Challenge and Stephen Downer is the winner. Uh, my competitor was next to me but he did a very very good job. And so we do a quick interview um, about Stephen. What are you doing in daily life? Well, day to day life is uh, working a full time job and then working kind of another full time job at the tea house, but uh, trying to find some time in between. And okay, so you yeah. have your own tea house. Yes, uh, my wife and I own Sipping Streams Tea House in Fairbanks, Alaska. Okay, nice. And uh, what's your specialty? Which teas are your special thing you're working with? We carry about 25 teas. Uh, what good? Good variety of Chinese teas, but also um, uh, tisans and uh, Japanese matcha. And, uh, so around 25. I love pu'er, of course. Okay. So but your favorite tea is pu'er. One of your favorites. Yes. yes. Okay. Good. And why is that? Um, I just love the taste. The first one I had, I described as drinking a used car, uh, a vintage car. I love that, and then the, the best one I've had was like drinking a vintage uh, used bookstore. Okay. So, I don't know. <laughs> I just like the taste. Yes, yeah, nice. So what do you want to do next with winning this title? What are your main goals or what do you want to um, express to the world? Sure. Yes. Yeah, um, I just like, like I said in the, the tournament, just to uh, demonstrate to our employees that uh, balance, balance the art of tea with the reality of business, which is fast paced. Uh, but try to maintain the integrity of both, um, and just you know whether you're you're dealing with a hundred dollar per ounce tea or a ten dollar per ounce tea, that the technique should not be the uh, bottleneck. So I just want people to know that, and I'm just a student of tea, uh, just learning, trying to meet as many uh, yes. tea people as I can, and yeah. as a wonderful community. Right. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah, same thing. I mean, I agree with that. Um, the last thing I want to know is. What do you think the future of tea is in, in, in America or around the world nowadays? How do you see it in a couple of years? What do you see yeah. that will change? I, I think tea will continue to grow in the United States. Um, I don't think it's, it will look maybe necessarily the same as coffee because there is that aspect of enjoyment and appreciation. Uh, and so it can be fast and to go, but there's going to be I hope we retain some of that uh, that element so nice. as it grows. Okay, thanks. Thank you very much. Good luck with everything. Thank you. Very nice meeting you. Nice and to I'll meet definitely you. maybe go and visit you one time in Alaska. Please do. Okay. Thank you. And this was the World Tea Expo 2011 in Las Vegas.